25-17 to force that fifth set, but lost by four in the fifth and final set. We are underway with first serve here in West Lafayette. Renner setting up Hudson. That's dug by number 17, Paula Cerame. Long ball, gonna be out of bounds and point Hoosiers to start. Out of the middle blocker position between injury and poor performance. Just finally trying to get their feet under him. Raven Coleman puts that up and she puts it down. Boilermakers just at 11. Hoosiers storming strong here in this first set. Looking to come out with a 1-0 lead. Raven Colvin punches that down at the center of the net. Her second kill of the day. 3-0 scoring run for the Hoosiers. They're looking to close it out. Chin puts it back into play, and Skimmerhorn will give a free ball to the Hoosiers. They're gonna set it up over on the outside, and it's almost a block. It is a block for the Boilermakers. Hannah Clayton. Allie Hornung still back at the service line. Purdue looking for their first ace of the day. That's set down the middle. Good up from Skimmerhorn, kept alive. Hudson's gonna send it over on the third touch. Free ball for the Hoosiers. Another set down the middle, and this time it does connect. Indiana wins the first set 25 to 18. Especially when she's feeling it, and it sure looks like she's feeling it now. A reach over from the setter. That was Cameron Hayworth. Ball clips the tape from Skimmerhorn, kept alive by the Hoosiers. They'll have to send it away out of the back row. Maddie Chin puts it down. Eva Hudson coming back to serve. It's now 20 to 11. She puts that ball low, put back into play at a back row attack from number 12, Greg Gosnell. That ball put back down by Raven Colvin. Emma Ellis coming in with a heavy swing. Megan Renner, the setter, puts it over, and she gets an ace to close the second set. Three aces for the Boilermakers. Now Renner and Brown have the share of them. Been tough for the Boilermakers today, but the still Purdue has the lead as the home team here. And that swing connects for a kill. That was Savannah Colheed. Ashley Zuloff, number 19, back to serve. The Redshirt Jr. from Wheaton, Illinois. Raven Colvin down the middle. Those were the points they were getting earlier in this match, sending it across to the empty space, but didn't have the control on that one to capitalize. That ball put back in the face of the Hoosiers. Block Renner Colvin. Purdue is a 100% in their side out in this set, eight for eight. Emily Brown dives but cannot keep it alive. She went for the pancake dig instead. If you're IU, you know you're probably not winning this, but you want to see that fire here in this last back against the wall. And Emma Ellis seals the third set with a kill that sails. Hudson with 15 kills coming back to serve. Set on the opposite side, dug by Skimmerhorn. Ball sent over. That ball great up from Skimmerhorn. Paula Cerame. And a rejection from Purdue. Able to get over that 20 point threshold that they've been knocking at for a while. 10 point lead for Purdue as they are into the 20s. That ball kept up by Cerame. Going to be pushed over. And another block back to back. And that time just comes out a little bit short. Eva Hudson tries to swing down the middle. Sent back in her face. Boilermakers will send it over on a free ball. Slight tap from the Hoosiers. Anna Clayton puts the ball down. Kill number two. 23 to 12 is the score here in the fourth set. Maddie Saris with the reception and a block from Purdue. And for IU, this puts their destiny in their own hands here. Now it's getting loud here in Holloway as that ball is out. And that's gonna do it. Boilermakers get their first win since October 14th. They end this four game losing streak. 
and sweep the Hoosiers 21 consecutive matches.